What's up guys? It's Brandon here. Wanted to bring you guys a quick video today. Uh, something really cool um, that I found yesterday right here in my local area. Something that you guys can look forward to. Something that you guys could probably find pretty easy because it probably grows everywhere. And that is pine trees. That's right, pine trees. And what we're going to be harvesting today specifically is pine pollen. And what that really comes from is these little bad boys right here. These are the male parts of the pine tree. Don't know if you can see that, but it's letting off pollen right now. And these up top here, if you can see it, is usually the pine cones are up there. And that's the female. And the male is here. So why are we harvesting pine pollen? Why would you harvest any pollen really like bees do? They harvest the pollen of flowers. Well, pollen contains a lot of phytonutrients, guys. A lot of phytonutrients, a lot of nutrients in general that maybe you didn't know about, but that gives you the extra jump on all the stuff around here that you might be able to harvest yourself in your local area. Things like cactus, you know, wild greens, and pine trees like this are all around you. You just got to know what to look for. Got to do a little bit of an identification, and you got it. You get, you're, you're on the road to wild harvesting your own stuff creating more youth and longevity for yourself as you go along. So mainly what you're getting from these is a lot of vitamins, minerals, phytonutrients, other stuff that people might not even discovered yet. But one of the main things, one of the cool things and why I'm getting it today is androgenic precursors. That's right, it contains hormone precursors in the pine pollen and really all types of pollen to begin with. But progesterone, testosterone, DHEA, these contain the precursors for that, and especially in today's age when we have people going through menopause and andropause, the male version of a menopause, but seeming to be quicker at a younger age, and I think that's a lot to do with the xenoestrogens, xenoestrogens, excuse me, and phytoestrogens we have going on in our environment today at an ever alarming and exceeding rate. So more natural things like this, more things like maca root, ashwagandha, ginseng, pine pollen help to boost the vitality, boost the libido, boost the androgenic hormones in our body to keep us alive, youthful, young, and vital until the last days of our lives, as the way it should be. We should live a long, vigorous, healthy life. Things like this out in the wild help us do it. So when we're really getting that youthfulness back from the androgenic compounds, that's really helping to get us get our liveliness back. And I believe that's what we're here to do. Be lively, youthful, full of just vigor and energy, um, helping everyone out, creating a harmonious community in which we all can thrive. Doesn't that sound amazing? Jesus. But here we are. This is super easy. All we're going to do is harvest some of these little bad boys right here, take them home, shake them out, filter out the pollen from some of the little leaves that fall off. To be honest, it's even better if you do an alcohol extract or a tincture with alcohol. You actually get more out of the pine pollen. But for me today, I'm just going to take these off the tree, bring them home, do a little sifting, get the pollen out, and have myself a nice tasty snack. If you guys, if you guys didn't know, it actually tastes pretty good. It kind of has like a sweet nutty flavor to it. So it's not like you're hacking down something that tastes really bad. Nature tastes great. How about that? So this is going to be my quick video for you guys today just bringing you one. I'm so happy and grateful to be bringing these videos to you guys now. Starting my own channel here, doing some good work, bringing out some cool info, and I'm just really grateful for all you guys helping me out here, supporting the channel, really liking the content, giving me your feedback, let me know what's, what's, uh, what you want to hear about. So until the next video, you guys take care, peace out, and much love.